We are children coming to the electricity. Children till now in electricity, we have discussed about the charge, we have discussed about the current, we have discussed about the potential, we have discussed about the Ohm's law, we have discussed about the resistance, and also Joule's law of heating. In Joule's law of heating, we discussed fuse, filament, heat. Okay. Apart from this, I have to discuss the resistance in series and resistance in parallel. Resistance in series and resistance in parallel. What is series? What is parallel? Okay, so by this we will be completing the topic, children. So also please, uh, please concentrate your children. What is series? What is parallel? We'll discuss. Good evening, sir. Please mute your audios. So coming to the series, sir. Coming to the series. Series means end-to-end -end connection is called series. What is end-to-end -end connection, sir? You ask. Everything. Suppose children bulbs are there. Like if you can cover bulbs like this, this is called series. Suppose children batteries are there, one plus minus, plus minus, plus minus, plus minus, plus minus. Minus is connected to plus, minus is connected to plus, minus is connected, minus is like this. This is called series connection. End to end connection. Positive is connected to negative. Positive is connected to negative. Positive is connected to negative. Like that. This type of connection is called series connection. These are bulbs in series. These are resistors in series. Uh, batteries. Suppose resistors are there. Resistors is denoted like this. If they are connected like this, this is called series connection. Please see the chart. Imagine three resistors are connected in series. Imagine three resistors are connected in series. So imagine three resistors are connected in series to a battery of potential V. To a battery of potential V. This battery delivers a current I. Battery will deliver a current I. Same current I will flow here. Same current I will flow here, same current I will flow on to here. Okay, children. Now, current, same current is flowing. I only, I am saying, suppose imagine phi. Phi only will flow here, phi only will flow on phi. But all of them are in different, different junctions. This junction is different, this junction is different, this junction is different. So potential is shared. Children try to understand. Potential is shared, children. V is shared as V1 across R1. V shared as V2 across R2, V shared as V3 across R3. Total potential is equal to V1 plus V2 plus V3. V1 plus V2 plus V3 is total potential. Whatever potential battery is supplying, three of them are sharing. Whatever potential battery is supplying, three of them are sharing. According to Holmes law, we know V is equal to IR. V1 is equal to IR1. V2 is equal to IR2. And V3 is equal to I R3. Cancelling I on both sides. Why I'm not writing I1, I2, I3? Because current is constant. In series, current is constant. In series, current is constant. What is changing? Only potential changes. Potential is different. Potential is different. Okay? Because junctions are changing, potentials are changing. So Cancelling I on both sides, we get resistance in series is equal to R1 plus R2 plus R3. R1 plus R2 plus R3. If all resistors are same, if different, if this, this we can extend it to any number children. How many you want, you can extend it to that much number children. If of course all resistors are same, imagine, then we can write an R. If one is there, one R. If two is there, two R. If three are there, three R. If hundred are there, hundred R. If thousand are there, thousand R. If any R is there, it is R. So these both are the converse of resistance in series. In series, overall length is increasing. Children, in series, overall length is increasing. When you are connecting side to side, overall length is increasing. From loss of resistance, we know resistance, resistance is increasing. Resistance is directly proportional to the end of the conductor. If length increases, resistance also increases. If length increases, because overall length is increasing, if length increases, resistance also increases. So in series, resistance increases. Overall resistance increases. What overall resistance increases is what the I'll show you children. Suppose in this series, imagine children, there are three resistors. Two more, three more, four more. What is the active resistance of this wire? 2 plus 3 plus 
power because Raman is asking to ask me nine more things. The answer will be more than the highest. The answer will be more than the highest always. It means the effective resistance is higher than the highest resistance always. Like this. So when three resistances are connected to a battery for each other, battery will deliver a current I. The same current flows through all of them, same current flows through all of them. That's why I'm not writing I1, I2, I3, I'm not writing I1, I2, I3. I'm writing only I, cancelling I on both sides. R is equal to R1 plus R2 plus R3. Here I took 3, so up 3. If I took 100, I can keep up to 100 also, no problem. So these are 3. If all resistors are same, formula is RS is equal to NR. RS is equal to NR. This is series connection. On series connection, you will do 2, 3 numerical systems. Later, remaining, you practice from the print, uh, you practice from the description. I will add some uh, numerical series. Okay, so one year, <coughs> one year can be each other, one year can be each other, yes, yes, yes. First question. Chill, two home, three home, four home. Two home, three home, four home. A, let me say is connected to a battery of potential 18 volts. Let me see. What are my questions here? So my questions are, Find total resistance in, in series. R1 please, plus no, R1. Wait, no, please, no, please. Total resistance right now. I want total current also. Total current in the circuit. And I also want current across two homes, current across three homes, current across four homes. And I also want potential across two homes, potential across three homes, potential across four homes. I, I want all these things. I want all these things. Apart from this, I want to add some more questions also. I also want heat across two homes, heat across three homes, heat across four homes. I also want power across two homes, power across three homes, power across four homes. This many questions are possible on this table. This many questions are possible on this table. Anyway, children, they are very, very easy, children. What is the formula for resistance? R1 plus R2 plus R3. So 2 plus 3 plus 4, 9 ohms is the total resistance of the circuit. From Hohm's law, E is equal to? V by R. V is how much, children? 18. R is 9. R is 9. 2 amperes. 2 amperes. 2 amperes of current will flow in the circuit. In the circuit, 2 amperes will flow. If 2 is here, how much will be here? 2. 2, because current is gone. Very good. Here also 2, here also 2. So current across 2, current across 3, current across 4, also 2 amperes. Because in series current is constant. Constant. In series current is constant. constant. In series current is constant. V2 I will write as IR2. V3 I will write as IR3. V4 I will write as IR4. Children, I is how much? 2. 2. R2 means 2 ohms. R2 means 2 ohms. 2 2s are? 4. 4. four. 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 Two 3s are? 6. six. Two volts. 2 4s are? 8 volts. 8 plus 6 plus 4? 18 volts. 18 volts. I told you, no, children. This 18 volts is shared as 4 volt here, 6 volt here, and 8 volt here. This 18 volt is they are sharing. This 18 volt they are sharing. Tension is different. Because potential is changing because tensions are changing. Try to understand. Now, children. Now, so children. So heat across individual, heat across individual. Okay, children. So for heat, time is needed, children. If time is given, we will do children. If time is not given, okay, let me say in two seconds. In two seconds, how much heat is developed in two homes, three homes, four homes? H2 is equal to I square RT. Do you remember this form much in yesterday we discussed? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I is how much? Sir. 2 to 4. 2 to 4. 2 to 4. 2 to 16 joules feet. 16 joules of heat is developed here, children. Those who didn't understand, actually, see here. 3 square? Sorry. 24 joules, sir. 2 square? 
Two square into three into two into two into twenty-four joules. Three into four is at twenty-four. Twenty-four. Please make your audio sound, na. Okay, man. Make your audio sound. So twenty-four joules. The piece is developed for children in two seconds. Twenty-four joules. And here, both uh, children here also two square into four into two. Thirty-two. Thirty-two joules of piece is developed. And P two I can write as I square R two. P three I can write as I square R three. P four I can write as I square R four. What is I square, children? Two twos are four. Four twos are eight watts. Two twos are four. Four twos are twelve watts. Two twos are four. Four fours are sixteen watts. So power is here in this register. This many sums, children. This many sums we can do, children. And uh, so, children, so like this, we are doing this many sums. Too. Okay, those who didn't understand this sum, without heat and power, I will show you one more sum. Without heat and power, okay, children. Without heat and power, I will show you one more sum. So you will have clear idea, children. Second sum, please, children, don't get confused. Very easy sum, children. There. Only thing is, you have to understand the concept. Five ohms, ten ohms, fifteen ohms. Okay, children. Imagine sixty volt battery and check. What is total resistance? What is total current? What is current across five? What is current across ten? What is current across fifteen? And what is potential across five? Potential across ten? Potential across fifteen? What is total resistance, children? Thirty ohms. Thirty ohms. R one plus R two plus R. What is total current, children? By three amperes. Sixty by thirty. This is total. Sixty by thirty. That is two amperes of current is flowing in that system. If two amperes is here, here also two. Here also two. two. Here also two. Because current is constant. Everywhere two amperes because as you see, current is constant. B five. I R five. B ten. I R ten. I R ten. B fifteen. I R fifteen. I R fifteen. Hello, children. Can anyone say I is how much? Two into five. Two into two. Two into five. Two into ten. Two into fifteen. Ten twenty thirty. Ten volt. Twenty volt. Thirty volt. Thirty plus twenty plus ten is sixteen. Sixty volt is shared as ten volt here. Twenty volt here. Ten volt. Oh, sorry. So total potential is shared among them. Total potential is shared among them. Right. This is series connection, children. So series connection is very very important. Okay, children. So in series connection, the formula is total resistance in series is R one plus R two plus R three and so on. If all of them are same, R is equal to R. Current is constant. Potential is different. different. Because overall length is increasing, resistance, resistance increases. Increases in the series connection. As resistance is directly okay, proportional to length. Okay, children, like this you have to do. This is series connection. Children, like the sums are very very important. So children, you can find out heat, you can find out power, everything you can find out. Children, only things you have to know how to do the sums. Okay, practice like the sums. Children, in the description I will add so many questions you try to do, and uh, I will also put derivation. Children, whenever they ask series derivation, don't please remember without drawing circuit if you derive zero marks. Some sort of thing you should draw figure. What figure you will draw, children? Like this, you should draw. What figure? Imagine three resistors R1, R2, R3 are connected to a battery of potential V, which delivers a current I. Without this figure, if you do derivation, I will not be gone. And this potential is shared as V1, V2, V3. Compulsory should write theory. This figure theory then derivation. Without this figure, if you are deriving zero mark, remember, remember. Without the figure, if you are deriving, I am not going to consider. Derivation means compulsory should write it. Derivation without figure, you should not derive. This is about theory, children. So problems also explained. So some more numericals are added in the description. Try to do some numericals, children. You will remember some of it, children. You will remember it. They are very very easy. Simple sums. Okay, and very interesting. Also. Try to do on your own, children. Thank you so much.